LA Clippers have a new arena being built for next season and they're trying to make it like quirky and futuristic. One of those features is what they're calling the wall. They're basically trying to make it like a giant student section. So it's 51 rows high. It's behind one of the baskets. You can see it here. It goes up high and like, here's the view from the top. Not great, right? And it comes with a list of rules. So if you want to sit on the wall, you cannot wear opponent's gear, cannot cheer for the opposing team. Tickets can only be resold in like a Clippers marketplace. And if you dare break the rules, you will lose access to the wall. Now, this back row view of the wall, let's hope that's the one for 5K, but still, that seems like a little much. This just has disaster written all over it. Let's be honest. There's not really a ton of Clippers fans in LA, similar to how there's not a lot of Chargers fans in LA. Chargers games end up being like road games for the actual Chargers, as the opposing team's fans fill up the arena, right? That's how this is going to be for the Clippers. Like, they don't have enough fans to create a student section. There are not Clippers super fans walking the streets of Los Angeles. I give their owner credit, Steve Ballmer. He's trying to be edgy and different, but I think the wall in this new arena is a swing and a miss. I don't think it's going to work.